Well, good morning, Southlake family and friends. Happy and blessed Thursday. So today I'd like us to look at one simple verse. It's Psalm 135, verse 4. It says this, For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself, Israel for his own special treasure. So we know that Jacob is an interesting study in the scriptures. Uh, Jacob, the grandson of Abraham, of course, uh, went through an identity change from being Jacob to Israel, from being one who manipulated for the blessing of God on his life, which God wanted to give him. But Jacob wanted it in his way, his time. But he was transformed through wrestling with God over the course of his life. He came to a place where God marked him and set upon him the blessing that allowed him to become the leader of the nation Israel. It's a great study for another time. But I love how the NIV puts it here. It says, for the Lord has chosen Jacob to be his own, Israel to be his treasured possession. And so our identity in Jesus Christ allows us to understand that God has chosen us each and every day for himself. We don't belong to the world. We don't belong to any other person. We don't belong to ourselves. But we, in Christ, belong to God, and God sees us as a treasure. He sees us, as the NIV says here, as his treasured possession. So he wants a relationship with you and with me today that is intimate, that is significant, and he wants you to sense his blessing upon your life because in Jesus Christ, that blessing is sure. There's nothing you can do to make it happen but it's something that is already given to you in Christ and to live out of that every day, understanding that you are chosen and that you are a treasure to God. The uh, chosen people, God's special possession, uh, calling, as Peter talks about in the New, in the, in the New Testament, 1 Peter 2.9 says this, that you're a chosen people, God's special possession, and then listen to this, that you may be declaring the praises of him who called you out of darkness into his wonderful light. So let's live South Lake family and friends today in the reality and the awareness today that there's a calling on your life. You're chosen by God. You're special to him. And the, what he wants to do today, because he's put you in this dark world in a place of where you can be his light, declaring his praise, praising him throughout this day and declaring that praise to the world around you. Let's pray. Lord, today we uh, thank you for the calling that you have on our life. Thank you for that we're chosen. Thank you we're special. Help us to live in that awareness today. We ask you to provide for, protect, and bless us. Provide, protect, and direct us, our families, our church family. And we'll give you all the praise in Jesus' name. Say amen with me, will you? Well, amen and amen. Well, God bless. Have a great day today. And I'll look forward to talking to you again tomorrow. God bless.